Let's see. Ah. <laughs> oh, God. I'm not certain what Beast Totem, maybe. What does Beast Totem do? Yeah, fuck it, why not? March on! Okay, so what can I set up? I have not set up the oil, I have set up the traps. Am I still encumbered? That I am. A frail, disheveled old man wearing a stained and tattered robe gives you a gloomy look. I'm Bucken, local herbalist. What brings you here? Tell me about yourself, Bucken. What's there to tell? I'm an herbalist. Make potions and sell them. Gather herbs, roots, berries. I live in the forest, live off the land. Since leaving Restov for these parts, I ended up a merchant here at Oleg and Svetlana's post. They let me in out of kindness, help me with things. They bring me water or firewood when it's cold and the occasional barrel of honey. They're good people. We could use your help. Where's this coming from? You want an old man like me to fight? Here, take this potion. Consider that my help in your fight. Fuck! Sure, why not? I need... to sell shit. That's supplies and rations. I don't want to sell that. I don't want to sell those. Cool. There we go. Thousand gold. Oh, oops. I could have put some stuff on her. Whatever. Didn't I... Fuck! I need a light crossbow then. Oh yeah. Hmm. Well, it seems this time around I didn't find that Masterwork Dueling Sword. That's unfortunate. I'll buy a long sword for myself. Ooh. 
damn. Well, it's a heavy shield, not a tower shield. Whatever. Hmm, that's not bad. Even though I have one identical, never mind. That wouldn't stack. I hate the fact that shit doesn't stack in this game, but I understand why. What does the masterwork quality do? Ah, plus one enhancement on attack rolls. That's fine. Cool. Okay, that's doing nothing for me. Uh... That's still doing nothing. Why? How is that not doing anything for her? How? There's no way. Hmm. All right, whatever. We'll find out. And save game. Huh. Oh, I didn't place out the oil. Hold on. Let's reload real quick. Alright, where the fuck is that oil? It is done. Is it over here? Adventures call to them. Okay, then. March on. Uh huh. So, is that it? Is that all I can do? I believe so. Now, let's save and let's fucking go. It's raining. You! We can do it! Strike with all your might! 
Is it just me or were they not impeded by the oil at all? Apparently they don't because you can't fucking hit them. Uh, yeah, I forgot to do this, didn't I? Run away, please. Oh, dear lord. More potions! More potions! More potions! There we go. Holy shit. I should have casted these spells earlier. There we go. Paps Biden. Paps Pabst Blue Ribbon. Wait, just collect all. What the hell? Why do I keep doing that? Oleg is breathing heavily, but it's, he shakes his fists. Fist in the air menacingly. You rats got what you deserved. Now they'll know better than to treat honest people like cattle. We should call Bakken out before he freezes in those bushes. Now, my lord, head on up to the guest room on the second floor. You deserve some rest after such a battle. I need to clean things up. In other words, get rid of the bodies. And this is for your efforts. Now, don't offend me by trying to turn it down. Just take it. An honest fight deserves an honest reward. If that were more common practice in this world, I think life would be so much better. You and me both. No if only humans actually gave a shit. But hey, that's what dwarves are for. Then again, there is a human in the in the in the peepee. -pee. It is done. Oh, okay. Too bad, I suppose. Anything else? Yep, I just looted everything in this person's house, and then I'm gonna go sell it back to her in the morning. You wake up from a nasty dream that tortured you almost all night long. In it, you saw a wall of unnaturally thick fog that surrounded you, slowly moving closer and closer. A quick look out the window, and you find out that fog was not a figment of your imagination. Not a dream. And then... Hear me. Please hear me. Can you hear me? Please. 
The half-transparent outline of a beautiful nymph appears before you. Even in this ghostly form, it's clear that she's exhausted. Her shoulders are slouched and her large blue eyes burn within her pale face. Her voice is barely more than a whisper as she reaches towards you. It seems that only you can see or hear the nymph. Who am I? Just a tear shed by the land itself. The bitter sigh of nature. I am a nymph, the guardian of this area. A defeated guardian. Call me the guardian of the bloom, if you wish. Beauty is so tender. Mm. It can so easily be crushed under the blows of cruel fate. But you can save it from being undone. What do you want from me? Aid, salvation. We have a common enemy, and long have I searched for someone who can defeat him. The one you call the Stag Lord. As a storm strikes ruthlessly with gusts and lightning, the Stag Lord wreaks havoc with the swords of his servants. And not just in the world of people. The land also suffers from the evil he brings. My forests. And my flowers suffocate in this fog. Soon even I will vanish as the last ray of light fades at dusk. The Stag Lord is responsible for the fog? Yes. It hides his fortress as well as his dark deeds. But while responsible, he did not create this affliction. It is the work of a powerful druid who has betrayed even himself. I know not why the powers did not leave this renegade, but even I was unable to defeat him. How can I help you? This fog it enshrouds, entangles, suffocates. If only I could learn how it was created, but my powers wane. I have barely the strength to call out to you. All I know for certain is that somewhere in this forest lies an old house, and it echoes with the remnants of a strange power. The Stag Lord and his druid were there. The fog hides this place from me, but I can point you to the bandit's camp near the Thornford. Make them tell you where this place is. Go there. And listen to the echo, catch the whispers, search for anything that can tell you how the fog was created. Once huh. the fog clears, nature will breathe again, and you will be able to easily find your way to the fortress of our mutual enemy. I understand. I don't believe in fate, stranger, but our meeting seems more than a coincidence. Interesting. All right, so... How long has it been? It's been an hour, so... I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please comment with feedback, like if you enjoyed, and subscribe if you'd like to see more. Enter here. No stopping now. Signing off. Mm -hmm.